Ground beef is jazzed up with spices, chipotle, passata or tomato puree and beans for that perfect chili. Welcome back to Craving Sweet Adventures. I'm Karen Ahmed. I have a very special chili recipe for you today. We're going to be making a Texas style chili. This is packed with incredible flavor and you're going to love it. Before I go any further with this recipe, do make sure you subscribe to my channel and make sure to ring that bell so you're notified every time I upload a new video. Now, let's get to food. I have half a cup of olive oil heating up and I'm going to saute a half cup of diced onions. I'm going to add two tablespoons of sliced fresh jalapeno and two tablespoons of minced garlic. Next, I'm going to add two pounds of regular ground beef. I've used regular beef, but you can add lean if you like. I'm going to add two tablespoons of my special barbecue spice blend. You can buy store-bought or I will leave a link to this recipe at the end of this video as well as in the description. I'm also going to add one tablespoon of cumin powder, one tablespoon of celery salt, and I'm going to add salt to taste. To make this extra special, I'm going to add some of these chipotles in adobo sauce. I'm going to use half a can, this is roughly about two tablespoons. Mix this in and next I'm going to add 700 grams of passata. This is roughly two cups. You can add any other kind of tomato sauce. I'm using passata, it's a strained version of this sauce. Passata is made from sieved tomatoes and they have a bright red color, a creamy and a velvety texture and they also have a slightly sweet flavor. Mix this in. I'm also going to add two cups of fresh diced tomatoes. Next, I'm gonna add two cups of mixed beans. I've just used a can of mixed beans. I'm going to add this in, give it a mix, put the lid on, and I'm going to allow this to cook for about five minutes. Now I'm going to add in one cup of beef stock. Taste for salt and add salt as required. I'm going to allow this to cook for a few minutes and I'm going to serve it with cheese, crispy tortilla chips, corn, some sour cream and a wedge of lime. Enjoy! Thank you so much for joining me on Cravings Food Adventures. I hope you enjoyed this hearty recipe for Texas chili. It's perfect for the fall and the winter. If you love my videos, do share them with your family and friends. Also, make sure that you subscribe to my channel and that you rung the bell to be notified every time I upload a new video. And if you love my recipes, leave me a comment below. I really love hearing from you. Also, follow me behind the scenes on all my social channels. I'm on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter, and TikTok. Until I see you next time. Do take care. Happy eating. Bye.